Hello, welcome to Mooch, the Hand Laboratory's online video tutorial. The Hand Lab does scientific research into human hand movements and touch perception. We use methods like behaviour, motion tracking, electromyography, as well as brain stimulation. We've put together a series of videos to help students, collaborators and researchers more generally understand our research and our methods. There's going to be about 60 of these video tutorials overall. In this first one, I'm just going to outline the series as a whole and give you a general introduction. But before I start, I'd just like to explain our name. Mooch stands for Massive Open Online Course Given by the Hand Lab. But in English, Mooch also means to sort of hang around and browse, not necessarily with a, a clear purpose. So I'd just like to invite you to mooch around our mooch, and if you have any comments or criticisms or corrections, then comment on the YouTube channel or send us an email at handlab at neurobiography.info. The first purpose of mooch is to give students who come to work in the laboratory uh, an online video resource to help support their learning and guide their research. Hopefully this will help them get to know what goes on in the lab more generally, how to use the equipment, and also how to let them know how they can contribute during their own project. The first 20 videos are mostly for hand lab members. They're in three chapters, named from HL 1.1, HL 1.2, HL 1.3, then the second chapter, HL 2.1, and so on, and the third chapter, HL 3.1. The second purpose of Mooch is to give all students and researchers more generally an introduction to the research we do in the hand lab. And in particular, we want to focus on the methods that we use. And the most important of those methods is transcranial magnetic stimulation, or TMS. There are three chapters of videos which give a general introduction to TMS. These should be useful for anyone learning about or using TMS in their research. These chapters give a general introduction, TMS 1.1, an overview of fundamental methods, TMS 2.1, and experimental design, TMS 3.1. Finally, the third purpose of Mooch is to give an advanced treatment of the research methods transcranial magnetic stimulation, TMS, and electromyography, EMG. There are five chapters devoted to these two methods in Mooch. The first two chapters give a general introduction to EMG. These chapters start with videos EMG 1.1 and EMG 2.1. The next three chapters are about TMS. The first chapter begins with TMS 4.1 and this describes and discusses the motor evoked potential or MEP. The second chapter begins with TMS 5.1. This looks at using other brain imaging methods to improve your TMS research. The final chapter in Mooch begins with TMS 6.1 and looks at the many different TMS protocols that are available. All students of the Hand Lab should start with chapters HL1, HL2 and HL3. If you're using TMS in a short research project, maybe supervised by others, or if you're just interested to know a little bit more, then start with TMS1, TMS2, and TMS3. If you're using TMS a lot, for example, if you're running your own TMS research, or if you're just very interested in these topics, then complete EMG chapters one and two, and TMS chapters four, five, and six. I hope you find these videos useful for your teaching, your learning, and your research. If you have any comments at all, or corrections or clarifications, then please let us know either by commenting on the YouTube channel or sending us an email at handlab at neurobiography.info. So, please have a mooch around and enjoy the show. Minnie the moocher from the future She was raised by neither nature nor nurture She had a metal front and a plastic back But in the middle was a lot of soul and that's a fact she started messing round with the king of Saturn He looked like a purple psychedelic pattern His heart went zing when she did her thing And before long she was walking off with Saturn's ring